Gen 2 solar inverters are at their core off-the-grid or off-grid inverters. However, they do support all modern wireless capabilities. These include over-the-air software updates, tweaks, enhancements, as well as remote monitoring and controls, all of which are completely optional for the end user, keeping in form with a true off-the-grid inverter. However, for those of you who are interested in a connected inverter, this video will give you a detailed look at the features offered by our Wi-Fi capabilities. So, stay tuned. Well, hey everyone, how's it going? Sean here at Genetry Solar, and before I get into this video, I want to talk about this video's sponsor, which is no one. That's right, Genetry Solar is an American small business with inverters that are hand assembled right here in the United States using globally sourced parts, custom designed and produced for our products. If you are interested in supporting an American small business, I encourage you to head over to our website, genetrysolar.com. That's where you will find our inverter line as well as other parts such as battery balancers. Now, forums.genetrysolar.com is a great way to connect with us and Sid and our nice community that we are building over there. Now, if you want to contact me directly, you can do so at 833-GENETRY, toll free Monday through Friday, 9 to 4 Eastern Daylight Time. You can also contact me on the website. So as I had mentioned earlier, Genetry Solar inverters are designed primarily for off-the-grid use. The inverter is powered by a battery bank, which is charged by wind, solar, or generator, and you have what is essentially a microgrid in your home. Now, despite the fact that we are off the grid, our inverters still employ all modern Wi-Fi and over-the-air features. Now, I would like to pause here and say that our Wi-Fi chip can be completely disabled and Genetry Solar does not in any way track any customer data, location, or historical use even when you are connected to the internet. A completely disabled Wi-Fi means just that, disabled. Big Brother cannot watch you either way. Genetry Solar Inverters offer a comprehensive feature set that allows the end user to not only monitor vital stats of the inverter, but also take complete control of the inverter through screen mirroring. Best of all, it's free. No monthly plans, no purchase add-ons, no paywalls, no complicated mess. Free means free after you purchase the inverter, of course. Now I have done a detailed how to get connected video, which I will link here, and that will allow you to take advantage of all we have to offer. Every Genetry Solar Inverter comes with Wi-Fi. There is a Wi-Fi tab on the LCD screen. Just use the navigation buttons to bring up the Wi-Fi tab, enter that tab, and you will see quite a few options pertaining to your very own Wi-Fi setup. So really the first thing I want to talk about is the over-the-air updates. Periodically, Genetry Solar will release a new software update to the inverter, which can include new features, enhancements, stability updates, and even bug fixes. When available, you will see this new version displayed on the update line. Choosing this update will download said update, install the update to the inverter, and then restart the inverter. Please note that the inverter will be offline for the entire update process, which usually takes uh, about a minute or so, and then you will be on the latest firmware. But there is one great thing about our inverters that you may not have ever considered. Not all of our software updates actually come from our own list. Some of these updates are actually customer requests. Now imagine calling us up and requesting a new feature to be added to the inverter, which will benefit you, maybe others as well. See if you can call up our competitors with any of your requests. Let me give you a few examples. So the first example, we did have a customer who requested that the power LED switch be disabled. That is the LED itself. Kind of like a night mode, if you will. 
Well, a few lines of code later, and it was not only pushed to that one customer through a tech branch update, but also eventually pushed to all of our remaining customers. Another great example would be a battery percentage reading on the screen versus a voltage only reading on the screen. Now, this was requested by one of our customers who was away from home for long periods of time, and then it made it an easier way for his wife to understand the state of charge for their battery bank. These are just two examples of the many features we have added to our inverters to meet our individual customer needs that also may be useful for other customers. Now, of course, this can only be done if the hardware supports it. But as a side note, a lot of our hardware that we have on our boards now is the result of customers using our inverters, sometimes outside of the norm. So we usually add protections to the inverters to prevent premature failure. So our willingness to add a feature that may only benefit a single customer should really drive home the fact that we actually do care about our customers. We care about our customers' experience, even if they only purchase a single inverter from us their entire life. So now I wanna move on to the remote monitoring ability that the GS Inverter line is capable of. If you go to your Wi-Fi tab on the inverter and scroll down to STA or static IP, you will see the IP address that the inverter has been assigned by your local Wi-Fi router. Again, this assumes that you have set up the inverter to connect it to your local internet, if not, here's that video again that will help you get set up. Now, all you need to do is point a Windows, Mac, Android, or iOS web browser to that location, adding a slash remote.htm to bring up the stats screen. Here you will see an easy to read dashboard displaying the most critical vitals of your inverter. These are easy to read and they can be displayed on a tablet full time where you can actually mount that tablet on a wall in a room or even multiple rooms for an at the glance health monitor. Now also displayed on this page is fan speed, inverter temperature, any errors or warnings, lifetime stats as well as some basic controls. Now this page can also be accessed from anywhere in the world provided your router supports it as well as registering the inverter with our remote login server. If you are interested in how to register your inverter, please see the video here with detailed instructions on how to get your inverter registered with our remote server. Have no fear. We still do not track any customer information or stats with that server. So in order to gain access to this page from anywhere in the world, you would simply go to the link here with any compatible browser, wifi.genitrysolar.com. You will be greeted with a login credential and you will be able to then monitor one or more inverters while away from your home or the inverter location provided the inverter has a stable internet connection. For those of you who are on a limited bandwidth, rest assured that the amount of data that's transferred during the remote monitoring is minimal. Also for those who might be worried about someone else monitoring your system, each inverter has a unique ID and you register that ID with your login account. It is currently not possible to have the same inverter registered with multiple accounts. So the next part of our remote feature set is the screen mirror, which is basically full control of the inverter as if you were standing right in front of it using the LCD. It will display the LCD on a local server for you to manipulate much like you would in a physical form. Going to that same local IP address as before, which was assigned by your router, you can choose the screen mirror tab in which the inverter LCD screen as well as controls will be displayed for your manipulation. So long as you are in range with your local network, you will be able to provide full control over the inverter from a local location. Please note that as of this video, Screen Mirror is not available on our web server for security reasons, but plans are be considered to bring this feature to our customers with a future update to our remote server. It is, however, possible to make use of port forwarding on your router to gain access, but that's beyond the scope of this video, and it is not encouraged by Genetry Solar. Now, as an added bonus, 
All of our new Gen 3 solar inverters feature data ports for RS-232, 485, or CAN bus, depending on the customer's requested configuration. And it may be possible to display on your portal all of your off-the-grid devices connected, such as charge controllers and BMS systems. This will, of course, require a future software update, but the hardware does, in fact, support this. So let's conclude this video with a quick recap. All Genetry Solar Inverters have built-in Wi-Fi that can be disabled if so desired. Wi-Fi enabled does allow firmware updates to enhance or improve the inverter and may even allow you, the customer, to request a feature be added in software to meet your needs. It enables inverter monitoring either by local or remote and it allows for local screen mirroring giving you co total control of the inverter. The inverter you purchase today will only get better with age. I would like to thank you all for watching this video. Genetry Solar is a small business in the United States. We assemble our inverters here, right here in the United States. We offer great warranties as well as great customer service. Please visit our website, genetrysolar.com, for more information on our products. I do thank you again for all of your support as always, and take care.